We are in Richmond. Over by the Richmond Estate in St. Anne. We're here to view a module home today. So we're just by the office. This is our office. This is the living room, and it's very spacious compared to um, Stonebrook. Huh? I said it's very spacious compared to Stonebrook. Mm -hmm. The awkward, yeah. It's cool. Mm -hmm. This because it's so noisy. This is the kitchen. If you want to be our tour guide, no, I mean, I want to shake it. Is it always shaky? It does not come from um furnished um the appliance. Yeah, it's just to give an idea of what you can hold in here. And that's a huge fridge. So this is the first bedroom. It's really warm. There's a closet around here. So the units does not come furnished, but the furniture just to give an idea what you can hold in it. Um, so you could definitely hold a dresser in here. And there's closet space right here, which is it looks like a queen it could be a queen or a really big full bed okay. you have ceiling fans and the ceilings are really high closet you have the stackable shelves which would well, I need more space for hanging here but you could take those out and just outside Wow, it's so pretty. Mm -hmm. yeah. I don't mind these windows, you know. This one has the arm, the mm -hmm. mesh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then it will give you this one here, which is not wood, right? They like plastic, mm -hmm. like a hard plastic. So you have a nice view outside. Yeah. All right, let's go to the other room. So this is the first bedroom. So this is the bathroom and there's a closet right here. Plenty of space so you can store stuff. You put your linens here, towels, other cleaning products and stuff like that. And this is a huge bathtub. Let me start from say cheese. <laughs> All right, huge bathroom. Let me just do it from outside. So there's plenty of cupboard space, mm -hmm. plenty, and the um the granite countertop. I really like these. I think it's quartz. I'm trying to remember what the name is, and a huge mirror. 
And so you could definitely all a double sink in here, but just for more space. Yeah. Really, really nice. Great. Really, really nice. I like it. And this is a three bedroom unit. That's a shower. Just a simple shower. Oh, and a huge bathtub. It's a good size bathtub. It's not the biggest, but really nice. So remember the last video I did, I told you guys I don't like these windows. But guess what? They have a mesh here protecting this one. So the mosquitoes and bugs won't come in. So now me like it because it has the mesh outside. <laughs> so yeah. So that's the bathroom. Just trying to get everything in there for you guys. I really like these units. Really, really nice. Mommy, no. turn on the light. Let me see how bright it is. Oh, it's already on. It's already on. Oh, look at that. So the lights are under here. Yeah, that's so cool. All right, so it's just a hallway right here. And this is the first bedroom that we viewed. So we're gonna go into the second bedroom. Okay, just turn the fan on. And this, yeah, it's okay. We can turn it off later. Is this a master bedroom? I think it might be that one. Okay, but it's still huge. Really, really big. Mm -hmm. High ceilings. You have a dresser right here. Um, you can definitely hold a chest drawer right in this corner. Double windows. And I like the fact that the bed is actually not in the window space. But yeah. I like the color as well. Wow. So these are the closet space. Oh yeah, the purple one. We have one of that, right? <laughs> no, the blue. blue. Mm -hmm. We have this um mm -hmm. blanket in blue. So there's plenty of closet space. I won't open the second one. And you have plenty of space up top as well where you can store other stuff. So that's what it looks like from standing in the corner of the room. You can definitely hold a chest drawer on that side, as I said, I stated. And you have a nice little view outside, except for the big wall, which is fine. But you have backyard space, which I'm gonna show you guys. And I love these blinds. So this is the second bedroom, which you'll definitely have to share bathroom with the first bedroom right there. So, turn, did you turn it off? It was on. Okay. Alright, so this is the third bedroom, you guys. So this is the master bedroom. Mm -hmm. so this is a king bed, right? This is a king bed. So let me just stand up out here, I'm not going to further. So you have the dress and there's a chair, closet, high ceilings, the fan is, is my phone on a slide down. <laughs> I hate this um selfie stick. I love this bed though. I like it. You like the natural? This set, okay. yeah. It's really, really nice. I love the curtains, yeah. The interior decor they did a good job. Mm -hmm. Well staged. Mm -hmm. Um so you have windows, um, in those corners I'm just gonna stand right here give you a overview of the room size really really nice I like it and I love how they put these two um, light cones there to give you extra lighting that is me. 
yeah she did a really good job i don't know if it's a she or a he but i really like it then you have the closet space which would be like the second bedroom i showed you guys so close it back all right and this, a view of outside from your window and these are windows as well they're just not open and the bathroom is just right over there which i'm gonna go next i really like this this is so cute i don't know me like this really really mm -hmm. nice i wonder if a course the cord is for them huh? courts i wonder I'm wondering who did it. It's really nice. <laughs> Alright, so let's view the oh there's another closet right here. I didn't even see that. Just off off the bathroom. There's a second storage. So you can definitely hold your suitcases in there or linens. If if that closet is full, you will have Space, additional space right here all right so this is the bathroom and in this bathroom okay the toilet is right there huge window <laughs> um, walk-in shower so this one does not have a bathroom so it's a walk-in shower which is a bummer still but i guess you could still use the the bathtub in the other bathroom and they have this huge mirror i love the lighting um plenty of cupboard space Let's see if they work they open up okay so they're not dummies they do open so you have plenty of storage plenty plenty and double sink which is really really nice and i love this um granite here so just out here you have a view of the outside so the land you get a good look of land suites i would say a decent size so a huge bathroom there's no bathtub but walking show will do because the other bathroom does have a bathtub and the ceiling is really high as well you guys and it's really windy over here really really windy oh yeah and the so it's really this three bedroom two bathroom patio house i'm gonna read out the whole thing i'm just gonna put the information on the thing take a picture then. it has pool oh yeah i wonder if we can walk over the pool Let's see. Let's see maintenance. So all this information, I will actually put it in the um, comment section of this video. So you guys can just click the description box. And this unit is actually two hundred and sixty thousand US dollars. They have a lot of amenities over here. You do have a pool. Um, I think they have a gym as well. We're gonna go out there and see if we can find where that is to show you guys. So we're going to exit now really love the unit huge hallway you have a really big space i love the first bedroom and it's really nice i love this <laughs> yes so this is outside we're gonna find where the pool is it's just right down here if i buy a house over here i would put on those solar panels so i'm gonna have to pay a jps nothing or them teeth. So she said it's just around here. So we're just going to uh, go walk through. Oh, we didn't go around the back of the house, you know, but let me just show you right now. back of the module unit mommy where is she said the pool over there the oh there it is yeah so it's, it's not a big land space but you have 
a good size so this is what the unit looks like from outside all right so we're just gonna go right across to check out the pool area and the gym they should have a gym they have a fitness center man. if it's not at this section because i did check out the website and it did show they have a fitness center and school. you can see the ocean from here really nice This is the gym. I guess they're trying to fix it up. Yeah, just starting out with the gym. They have the treadmill, the weights, and I press up something in them. I then go to the gym, so I don't know. And they will have a pool bar as well. As you can see, the refrigerator and everything is over there. A wet bar. Really nice. Really, really nice. Morning. So, you know, out here I have a family and everything and you guys want to have like a way to get together and eat out. You have the perfect spot for that. You guys can actually use all these amenities. Oh my gosh, and that's an infinity pool, you know. Yeah, it looks so nice. Tell me what you guys think, if it's worth it or not. Just wanted to show you guys something else other than Trelawney. So I'm going to come out today <laughs> and spend some day in um, St. Anne to see if we can get some house viewings done for you guys. Sorry about the wind, but if I don't do that, you guys won't know how windy Jamaica is, so I'm not going to cover up the breeze I blow. <laughs> yeah, so you guys have pool, you have gym, you have a little restaurant, so if you when you look at barbecue you can use the amenities over here i hope my hand is not shaking too much this is what the pool looks like from this side and they're building some other units over there as you can see plenty more really nice and the ocean is just right there you get a better view when you look in person than on the camera get mad at me and say oh me show you also I'm show you the backyard I just wanted to see the pool so I'm gonna go back and do that right now mommy boy show you the backyard space but I didn't show you guys and then I'll just put it back at the arm and then of the video instead okay so we're going around the back of the house to show you what the is that a June palm tree? Mm -hmm. That must be a small one. Show you what the land space look like at the back. Um, I've got the hose on for the, the grass, so I might not go too far, but this is the amount of space that you get in the backyard. And it actually goes all the way back. There's a lot of water right here. So I'm not going to go any further. But let me see if I can go. I know I went up my foot. But yeah. Yeah, my foot getting wet, man. So this is the back. And the garage is right there for 
for your car? Yes. So it's a good size. So I don't think you can expand with this unit. It's just the way it is. Yeah, can definitely hold. And it's still more space, you know, because this fence area is still yours. So with the um, the full bar under this. So you can use it. Okay. So if you're having yeah, like a little party or something, I like how they put the mesh over the the windows. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So if you're having like a little party or something, you cook from over here. You can use the fridge over there and. Mm -hmm. Whatever they have, yeah, use the facilities. So you guys, this is the Richmond Estate in St. Anne, Jamaica. We are finished with this unit today. We have one more unit to look at. Oh, that's a parking space right there. Um, the garage. And you can park all three or four cars right here. We have one more house to show. Um, it's gonna be in St. Anne, so we're going over there right now. So, see you in the next video.